Hi friends, my name is Rohan Bharat Chandra. Today's video is about technical analysis report which are the stocks in buy zone and which are the stocks in sell zone right now. Nifty current level 18,315. Nifty 30 days moving average approximately 17,783. Currently Nifty is in hold zone. It entered the buy zone for short term around 31st March or 3rd April which is Friday or Monday. Please note that this video is only showing indications for short term that is few days to few weeks and not for intraday trade or long term investments. Also the following indications are valid only for 15th May Monday and the indications will change based on the market movement. Point number 3 take action only if you have the risk appetite and if you know how to manage short term trades. Fourth, if you decide to buy after your own analysis, you may consider placing 5% stop loss to mitigate the risk. Point number 5, take decisions for short term trades based on what you have learnt in the workshop. Based on the red line to red line technique, you will know when to buy and when to sell. And sixth point, we have done research for approximately 190 stocks for your benefit. Stocks in just buy zone or buy zone. Company number 1, HCOC Bank and number 2, Procter & Gamble Health. Stocks in wait to buy zone. Company number 1, Tech Mahindra. Company number 2, Punjab National Bank. Stocks in sell zone. Number 1, Indarco Industries. 2, JSW Steel. 3, Tata Steel. 4, Bosch. 5, ICICI Prudential. 6, Vedanta. 7, Kenra Bank. And 8, United Breweries. Stocks in wait to sell zone. Company number 1, Gale. 2, Gland Pharma, 3, Jindal Steel and Power, 4, Tata Communications, and 5th one, Torrent Power. Stocks in Don't Buy Zone. Point number 1, Infosys, 2, LNT, 3, Sun Pharma, 4, UPL, 5, Adani Green, 6th one, Adani Transmission. Stocks in Don't Buy Zone continued. Company number 7, Adani Total Gas, 8th one, Dabur, 9th, Nika, 10, Voltas, and 11, PVR. Apart from these indications, most of the other stocks are either showing hold that is too late to buy or don't buy indication for short term. We need to see if this rally can continue and provide further profits for short term traders or investors. In fact, so far the rally has been very good, very good profits in short term for many people and also long term investors who are making a notional loss now their portfolio is in the green or is positive. So everybody is happy as of now in terms of how market is performing. If you like this video, please click the like button. Karnataka election result has come and Congress has got a majority. Do you think stock markets will react negatively on Monday because of this? If you think yes, type yes in the comment section. Otherwise, type no in the comment section. Thank you for watching this video. Bye bye and all the best.